Hello all. Hope everyone's doing well. Today is March 1st. And we have a box. Now it was delivered on March 1st at my front door. I don't know why, but the mail carrier put it on the other side of my door instead of putting it on the right side of my door. Uh, I don't know why, but just happens. So this is something that I already own, and this is going to replace the something that I already own. So let's get to the unboxing. So what is in the box? It is a Electro Harmonix Wailer Wah pedal. So let's check this thing out. So I picked this up because the other one that I have that I currently own now had a scratch in the box. So I had to get a hold of the company and have them send me another one because of the scratch in the box of the first one. And uh, this one's got a scratch in the box too. Hey everybody, what's going on? Eric here. Hope everyone's doing well out there. Today we are looking at the Electro Harmonix Whaler pedal. Yeah, these are kind of nice. Um, we, there's a reason why I went with these guys instead of going with a Dunlop Crybaby. Um, I kind of like the sound of these a little bit more than a Crybaby. Plus the um, user friendly and being able to carry with you if you're gigging or something. You have a pedal board that's already weighted down. Uh, these don't weigh much at all compared to the Ernie Ball VIP Junior, which is built consistently of all, all aluminum which has got a lot of weight to it. These guys are pretty light, easy to carry with you, easy gig with, put it with your, you know, pedal board and stuff, and uh, it shouldn't weigh you down any more than what your pedal board's already weighed down is. Anyways, um, another thing as far as being user-friendly with these guys go is I read about the Dunlop Crybabies is that the switch, if you're kind of going at it with the pedal with your foot, uh, most likely you could hit that switch pretty easily, I guess. Some people were complaining about that with the Crybaby, so that's why I went with this one. So this one here is mine. Thanks to Pitbull Audio for, uh, you know, getting these things out to me right away. These guys here, they're about like 80 some odd dollars a piece US. Uh, I end up getting them 60 a piece US. And uh, so this one here is mine. That's mine. You can't have it. But this one here could be yours. Brand new in the box, still sealed up as far as being inside of its bubble wrap and everything else goes. And we are not doing a fancy dancy number game or anything like that. It's going to be just pulling names out of a hat. So anybody who wants in on this, uh, just put a comment below saying you want in on this. And it's going to be U.S. and Canada only. Sorry guys, the rest of the world, it's kind of uh, it's a little bit of a pain in the ass to try to ship to Canada as it is. But uh, yeah, I end up pulling through it with the uh, Kramer guitar. And uh, yeah, I didn't know you guys had so much BS that you have to go through as far as fees and crap that goes for you know, sending shit to Canada. But anyways, Canada and the U.S. are the only ones in this. Sorry, guys. Just the way it's going to be. But yeah, all you got to do is say you want in in the comments, and we'll do a drawing on this, and it could be yours. So just a name game. That's all it's going to be. This is brand new. I like mine, so I, that's why I ended up getting another one to share with you guys. So anyways, you guys take it easy, have a great one, and we'll be back again soon.